Hold on. Profat, you got a minute? Why? Come on, let's go somewhere private. I gotta call you back. Yeah, let's go in the back. Private enough for you? What's up? I just left Reed over at forensics. We we're looking at the prints from the killer. Did I tell you that uh, Reed even got the prints off the mattress my victim was killed on? Yeah, well, that Reed's a real lab rat. Yeah. Your prints, my prints, Frankie's. They were all elimination prints. Reed wasn't too happy. She said we should be more careful at a crime scene. Maybe we better go back to the academy, huh? We were all in that room together at the hotel. So I wasn't even thinking about elimination prints until last night. You know, I was concentrating on the prints that didn't belong to us. So then I get the elimination prints. And there it is. Name, Profaci. Print location. Mattress. I don't follow. So I touched a mattress. No, you didn't, Tony. Wait a minute. You're telling me I didn't touch a mattress? Huh? You're so damn sure I didn't touch a mattress? Were you watching me every second? The mattress on the bed was new. The mattress I'm talking about. The one Suzanne Taylor was murdered on. We found outside the keller behind a dumpster. Miss it up. You want to tell me what your prints are doing on a mattress we found after you left? Internal Affairs is going to be here any minute. They don't have a name, but they got a tape. There's a lot of talk on that tape about a dirty cop in the 2-7. What they don't have is the cop's print on a mattress. I used to run into old man who'd see Elliot Al's clam bar. Without those prints, worst case, you do three to five. What? Suppress evidence. And they're elimination prints. Nobody would catch it. Hey, Donnie. How you doing? I've had better days. Yeah, me too. Affairs is on the way. A real parade, huh? All for me. Let's give him a couple of minutes. All right, outside. I'll see you around, Mikey. 